Being a pre-nursing student at Texas Tech University means following a challenging curriculum and developing a competitive and compelling application while preparing for nursing school admission. Nursing schools expect goal-oriented applicants who demonstrate an informed and experienced applicant profile that shows they are ready for the next level of their academic and professional journey. Pre-nursing students are always thinking ahead, planning for and working towards taking their next steps to becoming a nurse. At Texas Tech, pre-nursing is a designation, not a degree granting major. The traditional pre-nursing pathway is sometimes referred to as a two plus two program. What this means is that students will typically spend about two years at the Texas Tech main campus while they work on completing prerequisite courses before applying to their desired nursing school. Upon acceptance to nursing school, students then spend the remaining two years completing the requirements for their Bachelor of Science in Nursing. Students on the pre-nursing pathway are free to choose any degree granting major as long as they also complete the prerequisite coursework required to enter nursing school. Most students planning to apply to nursing school will complete their prerequisite courses from the pre-nursing designation, apply from that designation, and if they are admitted, never declare a degree granting major. However, if they want to declare a major as a parallel plan, they can do so at any time. If a pre-nursing student decides to declare a major instead of the designation or is required to do so because of how many hours they've completed, they will always be able to work with the pre-nursing advisors here at PPHC. The prerequisite coursework for students following in the pre-nursing pathway is designed to prepare them for the challenging curriculum they can expect in nursing school. Prerequisite courses like anatomy, physiology, chemistry, pathophysiology, and microbiology are laying the foundation of skills and knowledge needed to be successful in nursing school. We have more information about academic performance on our YouTube page in the Elements of Competitive and Compelling playlist. And while strong academic and exam performance are two big of the biggest qualifications for admission into nursing school, nursing schools also expect students to be strong performers outside of the classroom too, and we will consider more than just your GPA. As students successfully complete the nursing school prerequisites, they also build a competitive applicant profile by getting involved on campus, giving back in their communities, and engaging the nursing profession in consistent, diverse, and meaningful ways. The TTUHSC School of Nursing also requires that students be certified as a CNA prior to their first day of class at nursing school. It is recommended that students get their CNA as early as possible. That way they can accumulate more work experience prior to their application to nursing school. For more information about campus involvement, community service, and professional engagement, be sure to watch each of those videos in our Elements of Competitive and Compelling series. The pre-nursing timeline usually consists of students successfully completing prerequisite courses in the classroom and engaging in extracurricular experiences outside of the classroom for the first four semesters of college. They usually take anatomy in their first semester and physiology and chemistry in the second. With these science prerequisites, students are also taking the non-science prerequisites for nursing school. In between their first and second years, students should complete their CNA certification, if not sooner. Going into their third semester, students usually take pathophysiology, and at the end of that third semester, they're submitting their applications for nursing school. Most pre-nursing students will go through the application process over the break between their third and fourth semesters. Then they finish microbiology and any remaining prerequisite courses, but also send their updated transcripts, participate in interviews, and await admissions decisions. PPHC 
built a pre-nursing success roadmap to help visualize this timeline, and it is available for download on our website. The pre-nursing pathway can be a quick journey and may feel overwhelming at times. As students begin to navigate this path, it helps to utilize every resource available. These resources include, of course, the pre-nursing advisors and PPHC, but also campus support offices like the Career Center, the Learning Center, the University Library, and many more. If you have any questions whatsoever about being pre-nursing, be sure to contact your, your PPHC advisor today.